Good afternoon. I'm Philip Myers from Myers Metal Detectors in sunny Tampa, Florida. And today I'm going to show you the White's Coinmaster GT. Now this is their new uh, detector in their Coinmaster lineup and it's an upgrade from the Coin Pro. So now you have in their lineup the Coinmaster which is 179 Coin Pro 279 and the Coinmaster GT the list price is 399. I'm just going to show you some of the features. I tried doing this before out on uh, Treasure Island Beach, but the wind was so loud you could barely hear me talk. So at least here in this environment you can hear and see the difference in the targets. And the first thing I'm going to show you is the target ID screen. It's a big step up from the Coinmaster Pro because it actually gives you a VDI number which stands for Visual Display Indicator Number. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go over a half dollar and I do have the tone ID on so you'll hear the different tones and that one's bringing out at 8990 and if you look at the target ID it also has an arrow to point in front of the probable target which is a half dollar. If we go down the scale we can look at the quarter it's a slightly different pitch, goes down a little bit, it's not quite as high as number 84 and the arrow moves over in front of the quarter. Now we go down a little further, we'll go to the dime. Notice a different pitch so you'll get used to all those uh, sounds so you can pretty much tell what it is without looking at the screen. This is the copper penny which it'll read it exactly the same in the arrow actually points to the copper penny and the dime. Now if you go down to the zinc penny then you got a number 61 and you pretty much know that could be a zinc penny. It also could be a aluminum screw cap. Now we'll go down to the gold range which I've got the uh, famous pull tab here and I must have the pull tab notch discriminant uh, notching that out and I'm going to quickly turn that back on so you'll see it. I wouldn't use that notch discriminant at the beach because uh, this could also be a gold ring. So that's an easy way to discriminate like if you're in a park or in a house and you're just uh, littered with these you can eliminate it if you want to. Now we'll go over my uh, 10 carat gold ring and you hear a different uh, tone and it's in numbers in the 20. Gold can be actually from 0 to probably uh, on this scale here probably 60 if it's real heavy gold. And then uh, as we keep going down the scale we'll go down in the famous bobby pin. I've got a pulse induction detector and uh, I end up digging a lot of bobby pins, you know, when I'm out in the water, and a lot of uh, iron, which that's what I'm showing right here is the bobby pin and the uh, beer bottle top. Now, if I wanted to to uh, dig those, I could. I don't know why you'd want to, but I'll eliminate the uh, discrimination, and we'll make zero discrimination, and you'll see it'll pick it up. And it's got a weird uh, uh, sound to it, and it's a negative number 37 for the beer bottle top. And it doesn't look like it's even going to pick up the bobby pin. It just, well, it gets a negative 39 for the bobby pin. Most of the time, we're trying not to find small iron targets, but if you wanted to, you could. It does have an all metal pinpoint to get it uh, right dead center in the target. On this particular model over the Coinmaster Pro you also have the beach mode which uh, is a salt compensate mode which allow you to hunt the uh, wet salt sand and the shallow water, salt water without uh, having to cut your sensitivity down to like zero as other detectors you'll have to knock the sensitivity down to a quarter of what it normally is but theoretically you're losing a lot of depth and this will eliminate that problem because it's got a salt compensate mode. You also have um, automatic ground balancing 
and one of the neatest features of this detector and really any detector in this price range is the backlighting. I like to hunt, especially I'm here in Florida, and I like to hunt in the summertime and I usually like to hunt in the evening if I'm a dry sand hunt in the evening or at nighttime on the Pinellas County beaches and having the backlight is uh, an awesome feature you know just to be able to have that on so it's lit up because it's going to save you you know I, who wants to be out there in, in the bright sun and die them when they could hunt in the coolness of the evening when the wind's blowing a little bit off the water and still be able to tell what their probable target is. Uh, the Coinmaster uh, GT list for $399 and right now with Christmas special whites have thrown in some accessories with it. If you have any questions on that just holler at me. Uh, I'm Phil Myers at Myers Metal Detectors. My phone number is 813-237-1939. You can go to my website, uh, MyersDepot.com, just email me, Phil, Philip at MyersDepot.com, or just give me a call if you have any questions on it. I do stock this one as well as uh, just about every other White's model uh, that can be used here in Florida. Phil Myers, Myers Metal Detectors, 237-813-237-1939. Tell me if you have any questions. Thank you.